Hey fellow YouTubers, uh, this is Frank for Tiger Direct TV. We are trying something different today. That's why you see me here in front of the screen uh, for you. We are going to try to talk about photography. And this is something that we want your thoughts on. We carry the major brands such as uh, Canon and Nikon. We also carry Sony, Panasonic and Olympus. And for those who are very much into uh, photography as a hobby, one of the things that you may be considering is actually upgrading a camera body and going maybe from a regular point and shoot to a micro four thirds or maybe even an SLR camera. If you go and actually select an SLR camera, one of the quickest things that you'll probably come to find is, all right, what's the next lens that I should buy? And today I'm actually going to go over a couple of, of the three major categories for lenses that we have here. So I'll be using uh, Nikon and Canon as my examples. One of the things that I wanted to uh, talk to you guys about is what are these type of lenses. So uh, to my right here, we have a Canon 100mm macro lens. Uh, on the camera body, which is a Canon uh, 5D Mark II, we actually have a 24 to 105 millimeter lens. And then right here, the smallest lens that, uh, it may be small, but it does pack a punch, is a 50 millimeter prime lens. Uh, and then to my left here, we have the Nikon D200. On the lens body here is a 20 uh, to 35 millimeter lens. To my left here is a very powerful zoom lens. It's actually a super, super telephoto lens, ranging from 80 to 400 millimeters. And then lastly, right here to my left, short left, is an 18 to 200 meter, millimeter lens. All right, so what does this mean? You know, when you, when you hear about, okay, this one goes from 24 to 105, and this one is 50. All right, so what does that mean? 24 to 105 is just a simple way on a zoom lens saying that this lens is very versatile what we mean by a prime lens. So this 50 millimeter prime lens, what, what that means is, is usually used for portrait photography. And what, what basically means that a prime is a fixed position. So it cannot zoom in or zoom out. It, it's a fixed focal length f away from the sensor. So that's what 50 millimeter means. And also from time to time, it'll probably have the better f-stop for you. That means it can go very high in terms of an f-stop, meaning that it can go from a, a, a very low number. So this one is a 1.8 f-stop. And then to my extreme right, we have a macro lens. Macro lens are very much used for extreme close-ups. So these are the, the shots that you see on National Geographic about, you know, the super bug or, or insects or, or even, you know, the, the extreme eye close-up uh, on, on the subject. So that's kind of what we have here. So how do you pick a lens uh, in particular. So when we're talking about lenses, t think about what you've been using your camera mostly for. Is it mostly to take pictures of, you know, your kids or even, you know, just people up close? For that, you may want a particular fixed prime lens. So the 50 millimeter will be one that you may want to look at. If you are into landscape or outdoor photography, or if you go to the zoo and, and want to zoom in on you know, a particular animal that you really like, then you may want to get and consider a, a super telephoto lens like this one here from Nikon, uh, which you know, get, basically gets you to 400 millimeters close to that. If you still are unsure, or if you actually vary between your photography hobby and, and what you actually take, then you may want to get a, a telephoto lens from 24 to 105, in this case, or from Nikon, which is uh, 20 to 35. So there are several ways that you have to, you know, there's several options out there on the market. The best thing to do is actually think about how you plan to use it. How have you been taking pictures? And that's going to give you the best uh, result in terms of picking the criteria for your next lens. All right, guys, if you, again, if you like this video and, and you want us to do a photography series, uh, you'll see many of us here. Just comment, like, you know, share your opinions, or ask questions, and we'll do our best to actually answer those. Uh, for the next time, this is Frank from Tiger Direct.